What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. I'm going to be showing you guys a real simple uh, recipe. Super easy. It's more like a snack. Um, protein shake type of deal that you guys can make in between your meals. Um, if you're doing a keto or a low carb diet, um, this is great. I know a lot of you guys, the biggest problems that you find is, you know, when you want to eat something sweet, what do you do if you're on a keto diet? Um, and that's one of the most challenging things that most of us find. Um, here I have, uh, I have some All Way Protein by All Max Nutrition. And this stuff is excellent. Um, it's actually like $56 on our website for a 75 serving tub. So it ends up being around 75 cents per serving. It's actually 24 grams of whey protein isolate. Um, with digestive enzymes in it uh, and it also uh, is very low carbohydrate it only has three grams of carbohydrate so it's perfect if you're doing keto um, it has no sugar or none of that stuff it's very very high quality and it tastes amazing this is chocolate peanut butter flavor so what I usually do um, in between meals or as a snack or um, sometimes even my breakfast is I take about eight ounces of almond milk or coconut milk and I put that into my Nutribullet cup then I take one tablespoon of all natural peanut butter one tablespoon of coconut oil and you guys don't have to do the coconut oil if you don't want. It will still taste great without it. I just add it because I'm trying to get a little bit of extra fat for my total calories. And that, if you add a tablespoon of peanut butter and a tablespoon of coconut oil, it should give you um, around 21 grams of fat. Um, and then 21 grams of fat, then you're going to have um, 24 grams of uh, isolate protein from the milk. And so I'm going to add a little bit more milk, probably about 8 to 10 ounces of milk. And you guys can make it however you want. You could add more or less or whatever, depending on how, you know, how thick you want it or how much liquid you want in it. You can graduate, but these are the actual ingredients. And one scoop of the all-way protein, which is adding 24 grams of protein to it. And then the rest is going to be ice. And the protein actually sweetens um, the milk, the drink. So I'm going to take it and put it in the bowl. So there you go, guys. I have, here we have a delicious, high protein, um, very easy to make. Uh, high fat keto uh, shake that you could use as a snack if you have a sweet tooth tastes just like a peanut butter milkshake and um, you guys can have it anytime you can make it like in three minutes very simple to make and it will satisfy that sweet tooth that so many of you guys that are dieting doing a low carb diet seem to have a problem with sometimes um, and this will take care of that while adding uh, protein and healthy fats to your diet without having um, to break the rules so I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and if you have any recipe suggestions, uh, comment below, and I'll do my best to make them for you guys. Um, have a great day, and I hope to see you guys on the next one.